Hey YouTube, it's you go doing one here. Um, yeah, today I'm making a deck list video of my Gravekeeper deck that I'm running at Locals tomorrow. Um, it's pretty much Gravekeeper, you know, standard Gravekeepers for me. Um, I don't run Pot of Duality because I, because I don't have access to them, but if I had, I'd be running two or three. But yeah, here we go. Um, two Gravekeepers Recruiter. One Plague Spread Zombie. Three Gravekeeper's Descendant. Um, Gravekeeper's Guard. Triple Gravekeeper's Fly. Triple Gravekeeper's Commandant. One Gravekeeper's Assailant. And two Effect Veiler. So that's the monster lineup. For the spells, I'm running one Reborn. One Smashing Ground. Three Gravekeeper Steel, um, one Book of Moon, one Order of Darkness, two Mystical Space Typhoon, two Royal Tribute, one Heavy Storm, three Necro Valley, one Foolish Burial, three Nobleman of Crossout, that's the spells. The traps I'm running, um, one Compulsory Evac, one Solemn Judgment, Ultra Rare. Um, one, two, World Decree, sorry, and two, one, two, one, Tribute. So, the extra deck, I'm running Mandroid, um, Explosive Magician, Scrap Archfiend, Unchained Dragon, Urbalum, Castle Dragon, Gynite, Stardust, and Ancient Fairy. So, the good things and bad things about this deck, the good things are that it swarms really good. Like, first turn I could set, say, I could have a Descendant in hand and I could set a Spy. They attack into my Spy, get flipped, Special Summon a Recruiter, use Summon Descendant, use Recruiter's Effect, Tribute Descendant, to Tribute Recruiter with Descendant's Effect, so to destroy it, destroy a card my opponent controls, then I gain Recruiter's Effect, add from Deck to Hand to Gravekeeper with $15 Defense. And then I can go for a lot of damage in that one turn. So, yeah. If you like the deck, I suppose PM me. PM me with offers and I'll probably sell it, maybe. Um, you know, if the offer's fine, I guess, I'll consider trading it. So, yeah. Thanks for watching YouTube and enjoy.